Material Workspace is more than just a place for coworkers to share files. It's a place to actually collaborate on them, and it does it with the same convenience and instant feedback that we've gotten used to with social media. Material Workspace indexes everything. So when I do a search, it's extremely fast and efficient, and it takes me right to the location of that file or content. And in the case of a file, if I just click on it, it'll preview it right there in the browser, so I don't actually have to download it to my desktop, and that saves me a lot of time. Well, we spend a lot of time with email attachments and basic file sharing, and it works pretty well for us, but when we transfer our documents and files to each other, we end up actually creating multiple versions. Usually when we send out a file, we keep our own copy, but our coworkers now have their own copies, and over time, the number of files we're holding really adds up. And this can make it difficult to know exactly where the most current version of a file is, much less the history of how it got there. So we've decided to reverse that workflow. Instead of sending documents to our team, now we can easily send the team to our documents. And this allows our team members to contribute to the most current version of a file and review its history just by plugging in to Cario Workspace. Let's log in as the project manager for a marketing campaign in April. I'll create a page and start sharing some initial direction for the campaign with a few simple text blocks. I'll create a monthly schedule with a simple table using the built-in formatting tools and then I'll add a description of the upcoming webinar mentioned in the schedule. For the graphic designers on the team, I'll add a list of links that provide them with the resources they need to get started. And now I'll specify with whom I'd like to share the page, and I can even adjust the level of access they have. Now I'll send an email directly from my page to let the marketing team know that it's ready. And now let's say Mike, our graphic designer, logs in and goes to the page I've just created. He's going to add another column to my page and upload an image of the print ad he's just created for the campaign. And now he's going to upload the native design files. But instead of sending an email, he's going to post a comment letting other followers of this page know that his design files are available. And when he's done with that, he can go right back to editing those files using his native desktop applications and Cario Workspace will automatically save their history along the way. When Carrie, our web designer, logs in, the first thing she'll see is her newsfeed, which will show her Mike's comment and take her directly to the page. She's going to download Mike's design files and use them to create her own online flash ad. And then she'll use the mashup feature to display it right on the page. And then she'll create a file library, uploading multiple files at once so other members of the team can access them and translate them into their own local languages. And finally, she'll post a comment letting everyone know her files are available and they'll be able to reply to her comment and work with her files. Well, the number of business applications for Cario Workspace is virtually endless. And for as easy as it is to use, it's incredibly powerful in making workflow more efficient which is probably why when you get a team like this to use it, it's going to be very hard to get them to go back to the old way of working together. Right, guys? Good job.